It's Madden NFL 24, and it's brought to you by EA Sports. It's the Kansas City Chiefs and the Buffalo Bills, and it's all up next. Oh, they indeed love their football here in upstate New York as you get a look inside Rocket Highmark Stadium in Orchard Park. Today, we've got a fun little clash in the AFC as it'll be the Kansas City Chiefs taking on the Buffalo Bills. With Charles Davis, as always, I'm Brandon Gordon. And Charles, you talk about storylines in this one. I think it begins and ends with our two quarterbacks, certainly two of the best in the business. And nowadays, I don't think you can get by for long periods of time without a top-flight quarterback. The way the game is played, with all the responsibility he has and how the game flows through him, if he's not on the top of his game, your team's not going to benefit at all. And we are underway in Buffalo. On the return, Deontay Hardy. And his guys will get the football right at the 20-yard line. With well, the Buffalo offense coming out, and it is Josh Allen who is at the helm. And in this league, there are many quarterbacks who have their most success running the ball, while there are others who have big arms. There aren't too many guys who can do both. And at the end of many games, this guy leads his team not just in passing, but in rushing as well. Allen gonna fire quickly and get it to Diggs out wide. Call it no gain on the game's first play, and it's second down now. Well, that was a simple throw and catch, but even with that completion, zero yards gained, so they're behind schedule on down and distance. I think they were hoping to get it to him. He could make a man or two miss, but that window closed quickly. Another target for Stephon Diggs, and he brings it in. So the completion good for just three. And now third down and six to go. I think defensively you're okay with that. Here in the first quarter, he's going to get some catches, but they rallied to him quickly. And that's what you count on, and I like what you just said. First quarter, can you do it all game long? They catch it, you tackle them, they go down on the spot. Because when you're able to do that, and you don't give up big chunks of yardage after the catch, now you put the offense in a position where every series they have to work hard to pick up first downs, and you tend to stall them out when you do that. We're scoreless after one. Second quarter now in Buffalo. It's the Bills in control of the football as they've got it with a fourth down coming up. Here's the punter Martin out to kick it away. Oh, what a move. They'll score that a 36-yard punt, and it's Chiefs football, first and 10. Time to see what Patrick Mahomes can do here with his first possession. The quarterback out of Texas Tech getting set to lead this KC Chiefs offense. And when you think of Patrick Mahomes, you start to think about all of his attributes and you realize very quickly, you can't just put him into one box. No matter how the game proceeds, no matter what is needed, he tends to have an answer for it and plays accordingly. The Chiefs in good position to start out as they come up first and 10 at their own 46. To throw, it's Mahomes. His throw incomplete. I think he's got to be careful not to force anything into coverage right there. There weren't really any throwing lanes, but the best part for him, he's got second and third down to fall back on. Second and 10.
Now here's Mahomes. And his throw is going to be incomplete. Nice back-to-back -back plays defensively. They're stacking momentum now. One incompletion, two incompletion. They're going for more. Now they face a third and ten after back-to-back -back incompletions. Here's Mahomes to throw. Work in the middle of the field, and he's got a man complete. The Chiefs will use the first of their timeouts as they'll stop it with just over 40 seconds to go in the first half. Could we get a touchdown in this first half after all? It's first and ten. Now Mahomes. And this one is going to be off the mark. Too far out in front. Not the warmest starts throwing the football. He was one for three, now one for four on the opening drive. So getting him comfortable is the key. And for him, it might be different than what we think is comfortable. We're probably thinking swing passes, easy check downs. Some guys, they're better off throwing it downfield. That's what really loosens them up. Mahomes to throw once more. They'll check this one down to Pacheco. And they will get the first down here as they move into field goal range as well inside the 25. Looking to throw is Mahomes. And this one nearly picked off. Kind of surprising to see a defender of his caliber let it get away, but get away it does, and it's second down. This could be the start of a nice stand from this defense now after getting walked backwards on this drive. Come through with another one here, and have them staring at a third and long, and that puts the defense in a position to dictate to the offense. Now Mahomes throwing on second down. Quick hitter here, it's complete. They get seven out of that, so they're left with a third and three. And we see another pitch and catch there to the running back. This position just continues to evolve. They become just as critical to the passing attack as a lot of receivers' tight ends because their ability to make people miss in the open field can really generate big plays for an offense. The eighth play of the drive coming up. It's third and three. Mahomes going to throw. Oh, and that is incomplete. The Buffalo defense does its job, and it's fourth down. And here you're down in the red zone. You need to be smart, not force anything. So that's a wise decision to just get rid of the football. So they won't get a touchdown, but here's a chance to at least get three to end the first half. From the right hash, this from 33. Butker's kick here is good. And we have action on the scoreboard just before halftime. It's 3-0. So they're able to end that drive with three points in this one possession ball game. And ideally, you want to end every drive with points. Most quarterbacks would tell you, let's end it with a kick, right? A PAT, that's number one. Field goal you'll take. Punts, you really don't want to do that. In this case, they'll take the field goal and get prepared for the rest of the game. Four seconds, all that remain here this first half as the kick gets away. And he'll get it up past the 20 to about the 22. The final second ticks by, and that's going to do it for the first half of play.
So we've reached halftime. All we have to show for the first half, a lone field goal. 3-0 our score. As we'll head down to Orlando, that's where we find our man Jonathan Coachman at our EA Sports Halftime Report. Coach. If you missed the first half, there's not much to get you caught up on. Just the lone field goal accounting for the entirety of the scoring. A 3-0 game to this point as both defenses have been strong so far. Okay, Coach, thanks as always. This one's still anyone's game as we welcome you back for quarter number three. Just one field goal in a tightly played first half as we resume action here in quarter number three. And no alley to be found. The coverage was solid, and he's dropped at the 18. Kansas City taking the field for their second drive. And, Charles, we've seen almost three full quarters now, and neither offense can really get it going. Neither has hit the end zone, and neither side seemingly can make that big play. But the game hasn't been devoid of action because these two defenses, they've taken over and they've slugged it out. But I think you're exactly right. We're at that stage of the game now where one of these offenses, if they make a big play, that could be the difference. On first down, Mahomes will get this complete to Kadarius Tony, And way up past the 35 before he's taken down. We couldn't ask for much more to this point in the second half. A gorgeous day, one score game, first and ten here. Meanwhile, Mahomes' throw complete there to Rice. Now a timeout called for by the defense, and that's going to leave him with just one timeout remaining still in the third quarter. We'll see if that comes back to haunt him. We'll be back. From the 44 now, here's second and four. Headed straight, it's Pacheco. And a lane slow materializing there as he'll get maybe a yard up to the 45. Third and two. Edwards Alaire, they'll try to run for it. And he will have the Chiefs first down by a couple of yards as they're able to get four there on third and two. That's quite a spot there for his first carry of the game, but obviously they had plenty of faith in him, didn't they? No question about it. And here, why not go with the fresh legs? Able to push forward, pick up that first. Two first downs have him up near midfield now on first and ten. Throwing now is Mahomes. Got an open man. It's Valdez Scantling. So five yards here, five on the play, and it'll be second down. And that is going to do it for this third quarter of action. We'll return with more after this break. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Back now in Buffalo. It's been a very hotly contested game to this point. Just a field goal separating these two teams as we get set for the fourth quarter.
I mean, when every defensive play is crucial and you don't give up any points, boy, they're going to feel awfully good about themselves after this one. Yeah, exactly. The offense wasn't humming, but hey, all they needed was... Well, you can't score one point. All they needed was two points. Well, you can't score two points on offense. All they needed was at least three, and they got what they needed. They got what they needed. Exactly right. So this one in the win column for Kansas City. And not all W's are created equal, CD. And this one came in shutout fashion. Well, their offense certainly didn't need to do anything, right? They could take the day off, and they did. But the defense, they carried them in a big way. Yeah, look, the offense obviously stuff to work on. But they did enough, and the defense carried the load. Well, you know what they say. It's always fun to work on things if it didn't go well in your game with a victory in your pocket. And that's what they've got going forward. That'll do it for us, for Charles Davis and all our hardworking crew. I'm Brandon Gauden. You've been watching the NFL on EA Sports. For more, find us on Twitter at EA Madden NFL. With that, we say so long from Buffalo.